What about the backdrop of Paris itself in this movie? Well, uh, the Moulin Rouge is so much a part of uh, the, uh, at least the touristico Paris uh, that uh, there is never any doubt that that is where the film is set and which is the heartbeat of the film. Uh, and I think Renoir loved the fact that you had uh, both the ordinary Parisians, the, the bakers and uh, the laundry girls and, and so forth, uh, going about their daily jobs uh, in the same area that uh, these music halls like the Folie Bergère and the, uh, the Moulin Rouge uh, were on the same streets and that uh, they could readily go for their Saturday night out with their boyfriends. Um, and I think you also see at the uh, the more aristocratic uh, life of Paris in the uh, the soldiers that uh, and uh, again the uh, the fact that uh, at the opening night uh, there are the crew of a Russian ship uh, celebrating the uh, Franco-Russian uh, accord which had just been signed. So. Uh, Yes, it is very much, I think, uh, Paris as the heart of the French Empire, which of course is the empire of the world, uh, being celebrated by Renoir, who, uh, though probably not able to enjoy the uh, opening night of the Moulin Rouge himself, must still have uh, seen, as he grew up in the uh, early years of the 20th century, uh, the the uh, remains of this life still going on, uh, so it, it is yes very much a Frenchman extolling the virtues of uh, the French way of life and the French attitude to enjoying themselves and sex and uh, the neighbourhoods to which they belonged.